Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Justin the Light back for this banging music. No, I really like this music, but anyways, yeah, in this episode, we're gonna go through this door. I'm like dancing to this music right now alone in my room. Uh, I'm probably gonna put on my head other headphone. The only bad part is I can't really hear. Like literally it feels like I'm talking way louder than I normally do, and I can tell because I'm peeking out the audio. And I have both headphones right in right now, but it's a total banger. I love this track. Like, this is probably my favorite track in the game, I'm not gonna lie. But enough about me gushing over the music, I kinda did that last episode. So, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, gotta make sure everybody's healed up. Good thing I checked. <laughs> um, because Pansy is not. So, I'm gonna go ahead and heal Pansy up. And let's now go through the door. Okay. Three, two, one. Go. No. Go. What? It seems to be protected by two electronic locks that won't open. <laughs> That's anticlimactic. Um, shoot. Where do we find electronic locks? I think I have to go in the east sector again. Because there's got to be something I missed back here. Uh, something... Repel effect, yeah, I wanted more repels. There's gotta be something I missed back here, then. Uh, what did I miss? What did I miss? Oh, there it is. I missed it. Yeah. Get this darkness off my screen. Thank you. Alright, that makes my life more easy. Wow, probably should've done that for when I went and got the power cell. Yep, would have made my life so much easier than it actually was. Uh, but anyways, let's go back. The door should open this time. <laughs> I know this is like, oh my gosh, you could have done this last episode, but you're an idiot. Yeah, I know. Uh, but happy Friday, guys. Um, I actually know what day this episode's coming out. Actually, I don't, because this is like the millionth episode I've recorded today. I also get to do the strength puzzle again, so hooray, you guys get to watch me be a screw-up. Uh, which is perfect. Um, and I'm actually gonna go ahead and just push this up, and I'm gonna push this up, and then I'm gonna push this over, 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 I gotta push this up, and then I gotta push that up, and then... Oh shoot, I messed it up. How did I mess it up? Oh, because I had to push that one, I don't know. I messed it up somehow. I will... I'm not. Uh, I'm mad, guys. <laughs> but I to, okay, go back. Nope, go back through the door. I also hate that I can't run because I'm in a stupid freaking suit. It's a freaking Samus right now from Metroid. I'm in a Metroid right now, guys. A Metroid. My name is Metroid. It's Metroid, right? That, that's the name of the game, right? Metroid. Uh. Push. Oh, push. So I gotta push this, and then I have to push this. And then I have to push this, and then I have to push this. Haha, <laughs> I got it the second time. Okay, perfect. Hiss. Click! The door unlocked. Intense radiation levels detected. Estimated shield duration 5 minutes. Caution is recommended. Beyond this point, there is no turning back. Are you ready to enter the north sector? Oh, wow, it asks if I'm ready. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm ready. So let's do this. Location, North Sector. Estimated shield duration, five minutes. Oh, gosh, it's giving me an actual timer. Okay, we gotta get this. We gotta get this on the road. Let's. Oh. Oh, Lord. There's like just pools. Oh, uh, what's this way? Ooh. I don't like this. I, I wanna explore, but like I don't wanna die at the same time. Uh, oh god, okay, so this is a maze. I have to find my way out in five minutes. Oh crap! Okay, so this is not the right way, which is bad. Uh, crap. A uh, crap, crap, crap. This is not fun. Come on. Where the heck am I going? Because I don't know. Do I need to hop this? Yeah, I'm gonna use a super repel because I don't know if there's any Pokemon in here. But I'm, they're not getting in my way. I think I have to go up. No, dang it. Okay, I'm going up here. Haha. -ha. Oh, yes. I'm going to get through with plenty of time. 
Yeah, right. Are you kidding me? Okay, uh, let's go in the left door first. And there is... Okay, I'm gonna hop this. Uh, oh gosh. Like, I, I'm kinda lost, guys. I do like that I can still get to listen to the banging music, but... Hop over this... Uh, this... I don't know why I'm hissing, but okay. Uh, well, I can hop over this. Then there's a bridge. Repel effect, yes. So this bridge... Oh! FOOLISH CHILD! It has been amusing watching you try, but here is where your story ends. Oh! How fortunate, the son of the man who has plagued our existence. A child, the ch and the child of the ranger's chief, and now both are within our grasp. We expected the rangers will be willing, will be more than willing to obey when they hear that we have their child in hostage. Tell me, child, how do you feel to come so close only to have your dreams crushed? Does it hurt? It should hurt. We want you to suffer as we have suffered. Your friend. He is in stasis, neither awake nor asleep. His thoughts trapped at the very moment he entered the capsule. What could his feeling be? Pain? What could he be feeling? Pain? Fear? Confusion? Anguish? A single miserable moment, drawn out into an eternity. What is he feeling? It is but a fraction of what we felt. And now you shall join him! Once we have the hostages, the rangers will have no choice but to surrender. Then not only will we st will we stand in the way of Oh, then nothing will stand in the way of our ultimate power. Oh? Even after all that, you still wish to battle? Hoo ha ha, no. Amusing. Very well, we accept your challenge. Behold the nuclear energy and despair! Alright. Apothecary Curie. Apothecary with Nuclear on. Alright, Pansy, you're up. You're gonna knock this thing out with Surf. Okay. Probably should have gone back and healed at the actual center. That probably would have been good. But oh well, it's fine. I was like, what sounds so loud in the background? I can hear my brother's out, out in the living room playing Octopath Traveler. Um, uh, shoot, let's go with Surf. Okay, that was a good choice. Arbuck. Oh, a nuclear Arbuck. I'm assuming everything's just going to be nuclear. Um, that's my guess. This music's actually really good, too. I'm going to shut up and let you guys listen. Yeah, I'm back. Didn't teach Fancy Hydro Pump, it's too inaccurate. Uh, let's go ahead and Mega Evolve and use Meteor Mash. That should be good. Um, I need to flip over in to my editing notes because I keep editing notes so when I go to edit an episode, I remember what on God's green earth I'm supposed to edit. <laughs> and then I do my best to edit the episode. All right. I don't know what a Xeno Queen is, but it's gonna die. You're gonna die! Oh, withdrawing Xeno Queen, too. Back to Nucleon. Uh, more text messages, of course. Because why wouldn't it be? Um, I'm just trying to record here, guys. Alright, uh, I'm gonna say yes. And we're gonna go to Trix. Because Trix is kind of our answer to fighting types. And with 200 HP, she should survive anything. So let's go for a Moon Blast. Oh! 
Oh lord! I didn't know you could mega evolve when you're nuclear. That's annoying, quite frankly. Oh, that should be a one shot though. Bam! Done! Get out of here. Get out of here! Tricks, you monster! Alright, uh, Xeno Queen's back. So, Gerald, you're going back out. You're a beast, Gerald. You can do this. I need you, Gerald. Alright, uh, Gerald, you're gonna use Meteor Mash. A Proton Beam? Should resist it. Or at least, yeah, okay, I'm alive. That's good. Special attack fell harshly. Nice. Nice, Gerald. I've knocked out three Pokemon now? Three? Oh, Uraini is up next. Uh, I need something that's really gonna take the power to it. Big Patty is gonna be the answer. Big Patty, it's you! You are the chosen against Uraini. Uh, so this is the last Pokemon. Actually, wow, I knocked out four Pokemon? I'm good. With no deaths. Um, uh, let's go with Dragon Pulse. Oh, that stupid beam. It's gonna be the death of me. Come on. Live it, Big Patty. Please, 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 please. Oh, crap. Okay, at least it's special attack fell. I'm sorry, Big Patty. I know you didn't do much. Um, who has, who, who has a high special attack stat? Uh, let's look this over. Okay, special defense, or special defense. 112, 113, 145, 111. Yours is 107. Oh, Big Patty has the lowest special defense stat. Oh, well that's awkward. Sorry, Big Patty. Um... So I should probably... I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go with Trix. You're in, Trix. Um, I'm gonna go with a Moonblast. Because I need something that's gonna hit hard. And now. Oh, please, 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 with this stupid beam! Ugh! Of course you got a stupid crit. You stupid garbage thing. Ugh. Um... I'm gonna send in Pansy, maybe get a Surf off, I think a Surf would do some power. Alright Pansy, Atomic Punch, how hard is this gonna hit? Come on, live it. No! Dang it! All my Pokemon are dying to stupid Uraini. Ugh, this thing's impossible. Okay Twistar, you're up. You're gonna, you're gonna shake the ground. Shake the ground! Ha! Yes, it missed! Alright, let's go! Let's go! I know you're not Mega Evolved, Twistar, but you got this, brother! You got this! Oh, yes! That's awesome! Okay! Drill pack? Come on, you can live! You can live! I believe in you, Twistar! I believe in you! No! <laughs> of course! So the let's plays been going. Everyone getting wrecked. Okay, Volt, it's up to you. You're you're one of the fastest team members I have. You just have to hit one thunderbolt. That's it. You just gotta live this and hit a thunderbolt. That's it. That's all you gotta do. Oh, son of a biscuit! You gotta be kidding me. Okay, Gerald, it's up to you. All right, I'm healing Gerald. I've got no choice. If I don't, I'm gonna be redoing this whole fight. And I don't wanna do that, so Gerald's gonna get healed. Please don't do that much. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! Oh, but Gerald got paralyzed, of course. Okay, Meteor Mash, let's go. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, Gerald. All right, I'm going for one more Meteor Mash, and if I don't get it, I'm going for the full restore. I gotta be cheap about this. Yeah, oh, Gerald! No! Ugh, fine. Do this the hard way. Game forcing me to do this the hard way. Okay, Gerald's health was restored. Using another atomic punch, because you don't want to use the stupid laser again. Is that like a guaranteed paralysis? Are you serious? 
That is so stupid. I'm just gonna use the Leaf Blade. Forget it. I need something that's gonna hit. Ugh, come on, Gerald. Yes, got there. <whistles> Whew, I thought I was gonna lose. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Okay. Yes. 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 What? No, 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 no! What? No, no, no! This can't be happening. We're supposed to be invincible, Urani. Ha, 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 ha. How could you? Just a child, I don't understand. All we strive for, all this power gone. Urani, answer me, Urani. Ha 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 ha. No, I have failed us. I failed to protect you. The rangers will come for us now. They will surely destroy you. I'm sorry. You're still alive, even though you lost more of your power? That's it. That's all we need, Uranie. Use Quantum Leap. Justin, Justin, do you copy? Oh, thank Arceus, you're all right. Something was blocking the signal. I couldn't get through at all. Justin, I was so afraid I thought I'd lost you forever. So what happened? Did you find Kiri? Yeah, I see. So you battled them and won, but they managed to escape. Well, with Uranie in a weaker form, they aren't as big of a threat. Plus, it seems like the radiation that was coming from the power plant, too, has stopped. Use our, using our ranger corpse, we should be able to locate and apprehend Kiri easily. And that's all thanks to you, Justin, because of your courage and determination. Tandor has been saved, but what about Theo? Is he, you know, alive? Uh... Not kind of? Broke out of a stasis field? Cough, cough. Ugh. What, what, what happened? Justin, is that you? Where's Kiri? The last thing I remember is them shoving me in this tank. Theo, you're alright. I'm right as rain, Chief. Huh, uh. Being in that thing. It was awful. I had no idea how long I was in there. Justin, I don't know how to say this, but I'm pretty sure I owe you my life. So, did you know? Yeah, you know. Do you do it? Did you, did you beat Kiri? Wow, that's Justin for you. Losing's not an option for you. Man, it must have been an awesome battle. I can't believe I was wiped there but missed the entire thing. I'm glad you're all right, Theo. I'm sending rangers to pick you and Justin up right now. Thanks, boss. Sorry to disobey your orders. I was stupid and put the whole mission in danger. I think after this, I'm going to take a break from adventuring. I'm going to stay in the hospital with Dad. I'll be there when he wakes up. That's your choice to make. I'll see you both soon. This is Kellen signing off. Phew. I'm tired, Justin. We should get out of here. Come on, I know a shortcut. Apparently, Theo knows shortcuts through places we've never been. So, Justin and Theo return to the Ranger HQ. When they arrived, they were greeted as heroes. A word spread throughout Tandor about Justin's victory over Kiri. Going upstairs to greet my dad. Justin, I'm so glad to see you. Please come with me. He moved beds while you were away. Cameron woke up from his coma. I've already debriefed him about everything about how you faced Kiri in battle and won. To think that somebody else would overcome Kiri's power. When even I could not, I'm truly speechless. You've done an incredible thing, Justin. You fulfilled my mission. You protected all of Tandor in my stead. I woke up fearing the worst, but instead received wonderful news. Now I can be reunited with my son. I am so happy. Dad, I missed you so much. Unfortunately, we didn't manage to complete all of our mission. Kiri managed to escape our grasp, but we're performing a total region sweep. They can't evade us for it. Yes, it's true we can't rest completely until Kiri is brought to justice. But when Justin defeated Kiri in, in battle, it's powered down to its alpha form. That form is far less dangerous. It's not it's not highly radioactive, and it can't command other nuclear Pokemon like it like its stronger beta form can. As long as Kiri doesn't get their hands on more enriched uranium, it will remain 
in that weaker form indefinitely. There's no chance Curry will get more uranium fuel, right? Not if we can help it. For safety's sake, all the nuclear fuel rods have been removed from the region. We looked to impl implement alternate energy sources in their place. If Kiri wants to get their hands on more fuel, they're going to have to leave Tandor. We'll catch them before that happens. I'm getting back and I'll get him back in touch with Intrapol. They haven't heard from me in over 10 years, so it will be somewhat surprising for them. But once they hear of a dangerous criminal on the loose, I'm sure they'll be willing to provide aid. It's cool that you're a secret agent, Dad. I can't believe you never told me. Ha ha. If I told you, Thea, then it wouldn't be very secret anymore. Although, technically, I'm retired. Officially, I guess I can consider myself actually retired at the be as beginning today. I miss you so badly, Theo. I'm not leaving you again, Dad. Not for a long time. Justin, we should go. Cameron is still recovering from his injuries. He needs rest. And Theo? Theo needs some time to recover as well. What Theo went through at the power plant, it cost him a lot. It will take time for him to fully recover to his old self, but I think he, he will. With Cameron to help him. As for you, if you ever need to... I'm sorry, I've never been good at sentimental stuff, Justin. I'm proud of you, and I'm here for you when you need me. Now, I suppose the, your path is up to you, isn't it? You have all of Tandor to explore, but I think I know where he'll go next. The Tandor Championship at Mount Aconite. It's a new... It's the natural next step for trainers with eight gym badges, isn't it? The road to the championship won't be easy, but after how you've handled yourself in the hazard zone, I'm certain that you will have little trouble. In fact, I expect to see you holding the title of Tandor Champion before long. Oh, one last thing. If you haven't paid the R&D lab downstairs a visit, I think they have developed something that will interest you. I'm sure you'll reach your goals higher. Okay, I'm gonna go downstairs, because that interests me. Hello, Bambo. Justin, it's you. Come quickly. We've had a tremendous breakthrough. Take a look at the at Tancoon. Coon. Tancoon. With the help of Hazma, we've managed to absorb the dangerous radiation from its cells and personality back to normal. It's not hostile anymore. Who's a good pop? Coon. The new Pokemon Hazma has been in indispensable to our cure. That's such a creature could exist. It speaks to the infinite potential of Pokemon. It feeds on radiation will absorb all contaminants, I can never say that word, from the area until it is completely clean. This is the discovery of the lifetime, and we owe it all to you and Theo. Now that Cure has been found, I'm going back to my lab in Moki Moki. But Justin, if you have any corrupt nuclear Pokemon, make sure to bring them to Professor Sapirus here after they have been cured. Uh, their personality will return to normal and they won't disobey any longer. I've had the pleasure of working with you, Ernest, and Justin, I cannot thank you enough for what you've done. As well. I as well. Justin, words cannot express my pride and gratitude. I hope you will continue to exceed everyone's expectations. I expect you'll stop. Your next stop will be the Tandor Championship on Mount Aconite. Frankly, I'm astonished if you don't win at this point. There's little you can do. And when you do win, I'll be there in the stands cheering you on. So long. Alright. Wow. That's that's good. That's good. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, so, a lot has just happened. I am actually gonna teach fly <laughs> finally you guys are probably like you got fly like five episodes ago why haven't you taught it to big patty at this point no because big patty's gonna learn fly right now uh yes big patty's gonna learn fly because i'm not doing this garbage anymore uh i'm gonna get rid of thunderbolt because i have volt for thunderbolt so big patty doesn't really need it to all right and i'm gonna fly somewhere I'm gonna fly to Passage Cave, Nocturne, Kevlar, Moki Moki. I need to fly here, actually. The Tinkerer's Workshop? What the heck is that? And the Championship Site. So I need to go here, because this is Victor. Oh my god, Victory Road looks long. Alright, let's go ahead and fly over here.
Um, what is this? KSA stuff. Who are you? The chance of both. Oh, yeah. You're just talking about that stuff. I need the Tinkerer's Workshop, whatever the heck that is. Is this it? Oh! Oh, you're a trainer? Yes, ooh, yes, wonderful news, and you're traveling the region. Oh, joy, I'm so glad you came here. Ahem, <laughs> allow me to introduce myself. Well, you can call me the Tinkerer. That's what I do. Okay, so, hidden machines. Of course, you... Well, let me in... They suck! Yeah, they do suck. They're weak moves, so weak, so useless. Pokemon are not slaves, we have technology, so that's what I do. I'm a tinkerer, I make machines that do the work of hidden machines. Here, trainer, I want you to have this. The boxing gloves. Just put the boxing gloves in the key item pocket. That machine, it crushes rocks, yes? It crushes rocks that are in your way. Proof, yes, no more rock. It is miracle. Now, you and your Pokemon get to rest easy, and you, my friend, can also rest easy. Someday there will be no more, no more need for HMs, but until then, I tinkerer. Yeah, it's called Gen 7. It's called po it's called Pokemon Ride. Which Pokemon are now more your slaves than ever. Yes, you won't believe this. Another invention. Power Glove. It's probably an alternative for strength. You move massive boulders. Yep. Okay. Apparently, apparently let's see how many of these I can get. Quite curious. Repel effect wore off. <laughs> nope. Yes, I've done it. Another genius invention. The surfboard. 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 Yeah. Okay. Sweet. Cool. I. But I'm keeping surf on Pansy. It's a great water type move. Yes, I've done it. Another genius invention. The scuba gear. All right. I don't have to have dive anymore. Finally. Yes, I invented this scram. Okay, let's see what else I can get out of you. Ah, oh, the next invention will blow everyone's mind. Huh, I'm busy. Get, every get out of my house. Okay, cool. I got a ton of inventions. That is super sweet. I'm gonna heal. And then, in the next episode, we're gonna take on Victory Road. Uh, honestly, we're pretty close to the end, guys. I I'm not gonna lie. I'm feeling close, I'm feeling good, um, I really just want to power through. Uh, let's actually get down there first before I officially end off the episode. See what happens, why not? We'll get on the actual victory road. Just to give you guys a little snick pick. West Tandor victory road ahead. Alright. Hold up, trainer. Pass here is Victory Road. Only trainers who have proven themselves by defeating all eight gyms in Tandor are allowed passage here. Oh, are those the gym badges? Allow me to take a closer look. Normal badge, bright gem badge, surf badge, pixel badge, salsa badge, drama badge, apex badge, and zen badge. Congratulations, trainer. You may now proceed onward to Victory Road. Ooh. These late game tracks have been killing it, guys! Alright, alright, I gotta resist the urge. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode off here on Victory Road. I'll probably actually go restock on items and that kind of stuff. But I will talk to you guys in the next one, and I hope you have a good one. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Almost forgot to say that and like the video. Hit the bell thing do all that fun stuff. I'm telling you, this late game music is hot.